Lionel Messi remains the only player to have rejected Saudi Arabia. A few months ago, Messi was at a crossroads. His sad and depressing time had ended with PSG and he had three options. Go back home to his beloved Barcelona, but which was complicated because of their financial problems. Go to Saudi Arabia and receive 400 million euros a year. Or go to Inter Miami, the last team in the MLS table. Messi asked himself, what does a 36-year-old footballer who literally achieved everything possible get to do right now? He gets to take it easy, enjoy himself, and have some fun. And so he decided to continue his journey in Miami. On the one hand, he'll be living in beautiful Miami, and on the other hand, playing football there won't be as hard and competitive as in Europe. Messi's decision shocked the world. It seemed so crazy that Inter Miami goalkeeper, this guy called Nick Marsman said, Lionel Messi is too big for Inter Miami. He said the club wasn't ready for Messi's arrival, that they only had a temporary stadium with no gates and without security. By the way, Inter Miami terminated his contract because he questioned the club's decision to sign Messi. But the fact that the GOAT said no to Saudi Arabia and joined the last team in the MLS table and since then has literally been changing football or soccer in America and is doing it in style goes to show that this guy is without a doubt the greatest of all time. Messi scored the winning goal in his first ever game for Miami, led the club to win the League's Cup, the club's first trophy in its history, and Messi's 44th career title, making him the player with the most trophies ever. And then again, led Miami to reach the Lamar Hunt US Open Cup final by giving Leonardo Campana two incredible assists versus FC Cincinnati in the semifinal. And since Messi remains the only player to have said no to Saudi Arabia, will Mo Salah become the second player to say no? Will he reject 100 million euros, a private jet, a mansion, and lots of other benefits? Say no, Mo. Don't join Al Ittihad. Your work in Liverpool and in Europe is not finished. You're playing in the best league in the world, and leaving it to join the Saudi Pro League would be a huge mistake. Benzema already wants to leave only two months after joining Al Ittihad, and lots of talents like Bono, Fabinho, Neymar, and Mahrez will go to waste in Saudi Arabia. So at the end, all I can say to Mo Salah is, listen to the GOAT, listen to Messi. Thank you for watching, please share your thoughts and comments below, like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye!